Hey everyone, so I have another movie review today and this is Devil Wears Prada. Now I know this is kind of a late video because this first came out in 2007. Now I did actually go into the cinema to, to see this in 2007 but I only recently kind of got hold of the DVD to give it a rewatch and things. This one focuses on a character called Andy and she wants to be a writer and she becomes the second assistant to the editor of a really top fashion magazine in New York. And it's not really her field, you know, it's kind of it kind of has a small kind of ugly betty type thing to it at the beginning but it that doesn't last very long and she even though it's not really her dream job there she kind of battles away with it and you know she wants to move up she wants to get higher in the career and then you know work for other magazines yada yada but there's her rival her first the um the editor's first assistant emily is sometimes being nice to Andy and sometimes being a little bit sly and you often wonder is she actually really her friend or does she hate her because she she is the second assistant she is fresh you know if she makes a mistake it's not as bad as if Emily makes a mistake because Emily's been there forever and Andy does make quite a few mistakes there are particular scenes involving hot coffee and things which are amusing to say the least but it is really good it's interesting to see how Andy progresses with this job and the certain people that she gets along with, people you wouldn't necessarily think she'd get along with, she does. She learns a lot on the job and I suppose the audience, the viewers learn a lot as well. Emily is a character I can't stand, but never mind. The The cast for this is brilliant. You've got Meryl Streep who plays the, the editor. She is absolutely brilliant in this. I've not seen her in much else, but I've seen her in a few things and she is fantastic. She always is. But for me, I wanted to see it because of Anne Hathaway. This wasn't too long after... It would have been Princess Diaries 2. It wasn't too long after that, so she was still, I mean, she still is fresh and exciting as an actress, but she was very much new in my life as a movie fan then. So I was keen to see what she was like. And this has a surreal effect. As soon as I saw this, the first time I saw, it, saw this, I was 15, I said immediately, I want to be the editor of a fashion magazine. <laughs> Look at me. Yeah, right, totally. <laughs> but it does, it has that immediate effect on you. You get so wrapped up in this world that you want to do it. Now I am, I, I write, I, I, I will be writing for a complete living, I, I do, I write a lot, I write constantly. I, I like playing with words, so to be a writer for a fashion magazine wouldn't be a bad thing because I'd still be writing and fashion is sometimes interesting if it's alright, but I could never be the editor, of course I couldn't. But it still made me feel that, I made me think I want to write for a fashion magazine, I still would like to write for it, but um never to the extent where it could be my entire life you know I'd always want to be writing for for showbiz and for the entertainment media that's what I'd like to do so it did have a really sudden impact on me which probably lasted quite a while actually I did spend quite a while I bought a couple of like Vogue magazines and things after that I spent money so it made me spend money on Vogue magazines um, which are totally pointless because they're just pictures there's no the, the, the quality of the journalism in most of these top fashion magazines are not very good at all I'll be honest with you some of them are okay but generally they're not that good but the movie itself is absolutely brilliant and very exciting as I said really has a strong impact and it's really insightful as well and uh, really well written I really do like it absolutely brilliant please feel free to leave comments and let me know your thoughts on this or anything else if you've read the book which I haven't let me know because I'm quite keen to see how it compares I I'm not really too sure if the book would be any good because I don't think it would have the same impact as what the movie does because I need that visual but yeah so please feel free to leave comments on this or anything else any requests, do let me know on that video just now, but I'll see you all next time. Bye!